back to Wandering Art. Today I am doing a peacock pour. The colors that I'm going to be using are Warm Magenta by Lorez, Amethyst Dream by Lorez, Deep Purple by Lorez, and then I'm going to be using a dark green and then a light green mica powder. These are both really sparkly. These are the exact same colors that I used for the peacock pour that I did a couple weeks ago. And they turned out so beautiful together, I wanted to do the same colors on a larger canvas. This is a 12 by 24 canvas. And I have 300 milliliters mixed here, but I mixed so much because I have some silicone um, bowl mo molds that I'm going to be using and I'm going to pour um, the resin in there, any extras that I have. So I think I want the amethyst green and then the lime green mica powder to be my dominant colors. I don't wanna to put too much of the deep purple because it is very dark and I don't want it to take over anything. Also you guys, I'm going to be doing a video, one of my next videos, I haven't got to try any like spray paint on top of resin without you know mixing it in because I have been pregnant so I haven't had a chance and it's something that I have really been wanting to do so I will be doing that this week along with the bowl molds that I have. So these are my bowl molds. They're, they were smaller than I thought so they're going to be like jewelry bowls or like bowls to put your rings in after you take them off. This one is like a ring mold. This one probably be put necklaces in or something. Even like a soap or like little potpourri bowls. Or this one would be perfect for like a candle holder. It's the perfect size for those candles. So I'm going to pour any extra resin into there. And I'm gonna do a whole video on those, but these are kind of like my test ones. So we're gonna test them out. So I didn't cover the canvas first, like I usually do. But I wanted to try it without it. So, what we're gonna do first. I'm gonna do my darker colors first, the dark purple and the dark green. So I'm not sure if I like this piece or not. I love the colors in it and I love that all of the Lorez and the Bath Bomb Mica powders are shimmery, but I don't like the edges so much as I like the middle. So I might do a second layer on this piece or I might re-pour it all together. I'm not sure yet. I would love to hear your guys' opinions, what you think of the colors and the piece. If you guys have any questions about this piece or how I made it or anything that I used, let me know in the comments down below. Thank you guys for watching as always. And if you're interested in seeing any of my other work, you can check me out on Facebook or Instagram. They will be linked in the last page of this video and they're also linked in the description below along with all the supplies that I used to make this piece. If you like the video, Hit that thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. I've got a lot of cool videos coming out this week. My spray paint video. Um, I'm going to be doing the video on the resin bowls. And you'll get to see how the test pieces turned out. And I'm also going to be doing a couple other pieces with those uh, molds as well. And as soon as I get my wood piece up from the basement, I will be doing the top of my wooden table. So stay tuned for that, guys, and um, I will catch you guys next time.